check this out. I got these new glasses. Um, I hope y'all rocking with them. Um, I want to tell you a quick story about it, though. I used to wear glasses back in the day. Anybody that watched any of my old videos, I definitely wore glasses. I got some new ones. Um, and, and I was really bothered that I had to get new glasses. And on top of that, I had to switch like carriers and all that. So I had to go to a whole nother site. Essentially, I had to get these new glasses, but I had to get all these tests done, all these evaluations done. And y'all already know if anybody has glasses, you already know that could be a lot. Um, and so anyway, they, they gave me my new prescription. I was kind of upset that I got a new prescription because I'm like, all right, well, let's see how this going to go. I'm hoping it's not too bad. But I got these new glasses and they told me my prescription hasn't changed much. It's pretty much the same. And so I put on these new glasses and I'm like, oh, no, nah, these don't hurt. Like my eyes hurt. I'm crying and it's hard for me to see. It's like everything is clear, but it's like too clear. And it's like hurting me is like really sharp. And on top of that, it was like I was like dizzy. My head started to hurt. It was so frustrating. I just took them off. I took them off. I just couldn't do it. Like I, I saw it through for a little bit and it's like I tried, but I just took it off. I couldn't do it no more. It was just really frustrating. So then I'm I'm in this place where I'm like, okay, I, I need glasses though, because like I, I can't see. Like I can't see as great as I want to. I want to be able to see from farther away. And so it's starting to be hard for me to do things like driving, all this stuff. So I'm like, dang, I can't avoid the fact that I do need new glasses, but these glasses, nah, like there's got to be another way. So I said, listen, how about if y'all take my old prescription, put them in these new glasses? Because I was seeing fine, for real, for real. I, I could see. Um, it's just when I take them off, I can't see. But just give me the old prescription. I, I like that lens better. Um, it's something I'm comfortable with. My eyes are more comfortable with. I can put them on, and it's, it's good. And they're like, we can't do that because you have an astigmatism. And I'm over here shook because I'm like, oh, my goodness, what's going on my eyes? And then everybody's telling me, yeah, that's normal. Everybody gets it over time. Not everybody, but most people. Um, so I'm kind of like, okay, so I'm a little calm that I have this thing now. And I'm kind of like, all right, so I got to wear these glasses because I got something wrong with my eyesight. And they have to change it. They said, listen, wear the glasses again and keep them on. You're going to feel that pressure. But it's because your eyes are adjusting to a new set of lenses. And essentially, I, I literally just told the person I was, I was like, yo, I got to do a video about this because that's so good. I was like, you know, in life, something I realized. When, when, you, when you're trying new things, when you're stepping out of your comfort zone, when you're having your mind renewed and you're learning to see things from a different perspective, it doesn't always feel good. It's not always the go-to. It's not always something you're so easily submitted to. Certain ideas, certain truths. It's hard to hear certain truths. It's hard to hear certain reports. I'm figuring out I got something wrong with my eyesight. The whole time I'm thinking I'm good. And then I had to trust this process of my eyes being adjusted to new lenses. And what I thought about is just our lives adjusting to this new life that God has promised us. A lot of us are coming from backgrounds where we didn't live any way like how God wants us to live. Some of us are still struggling to find our flow in this new life that God wants us to live. Some of us know that something's wrong with our eyesight. Some of us know that we see things a little off because of our trauma. Some of us know we've been in certain cycles for too long and it's time for something new. Some of us know we're desperate for God, but we're just so used to the older life or way of living or way of thinking that it's sometimes easier to just stay in what's familiar and I guess I just got to this place where I said listen it's either I'm going to be stuck not seeing or I'm going to adjust to a new set of lenses and literally I've been wearing these glasses and lo and behold my eyes actually did adjust to where I can see clearly now I'm not tripping over my feet there's no more pressure in my head but in the beginning, it hurt so much to change. But now I'm thankful because I can see clearly. I can enjoy and see people in front of me now. I can see farther away. And it's one of those things where it really blessed me that if we could just trust God, when he takes us through that time of transformation, where he's asking us to let go of things, if he's asking us to give up things, if he's saying, just trust me, in this new life, we have to know that there is greater. That when it feels hard, when we have to explain to certain people, hey, you know, 
you know, I'm, I'm doing things a little differently now. I'm really trusting God with my life and I have to, I have to lay that down. I, I'm not doing that no more. I can't. Um, it's not beneficial to me and it's not promoting my walk with God and it's not going to take me where I know God is trying to take me. So I have to let that go. Certain people we have to separate from because now with a new set of lenses, we see them for who they really are. With new set of lenses, we start to really see our values even clearer in what we will no longer settle for. I'll share this. I had a, a couple really was fighting um, to really work things out. One of them was really, really trying to make this thing work. The other one was playing too many games. Now, the one that was playing games, I had to warn him. I said, listen, you can only play those games but for so long, but if they wake up or if they get a new set of lenses and they see you now through their new set of lenses, they're going to recognize who they are, what they're worth, who they belong to, where God is taking them, and they're going to leave you. So spare your ego now because God forbid they break your heart. <laughs> what am I saying? When God is trying to give us a new set of lenses. Just adjust. It doesn't feel good all the time, but that's your ammo. It's not supposed to. You're supposed to feel the change. You're growing. Your eyes are adjusting so that you can see better. It's for you. Trust this journey of adjusting to the new life that God may call on you to live. I love you. God bless you. And I pray that this video encouraged you. Hey, I really, really, really thank you for watching these videos and I thank you for always sharing them with your friends, liking, subscribing, and commenting. But something that I really have on my heart that I really want you to do more than anything is just to take time right now and spend time with God after you're done with this video. I want you not to scroll to the next one. I don't want you to go look at anything else. We talked about a lot in this video and I really want you to kind of ask God and talk to him about some of the things we discussed in this video. Anything that resonated with you, just bring it to him. I pray that you enjoy your time and, and ask him to open up your ears so you can hear his voice.